I finally washed my hair and I'm actually going to style it. So I wanted to show you guys my current curly hair routine, my current favorites, literally just two products and this brush from Where's this brush from? Oh my gosh. Oh, duh, it says it right on the back, Bounce Curl. It's literally my favorite thing right now. But my routine is super quick and easy because I usually don't have a lot of time. Right now, I'm kind of on the time crunch, so let's get into it. So actually, let's rewind to in the shower. I didn't record any footage, but I did use the Olaplex shampoo. I think it's three and four or four and five. I'm not sure, I'll insert them here. And before I even get in the shower, I usually use my Aroma Scalp Purifying Shampoo to do a little pre-poo, especially if it's been a long time since I washed, which usually it is because these days I've been going like weeks without washing my hair. Interrupting for our special guest of the day, Mr. Curly Hair himself, so cute. Look at the curls though, look at the curls, look at the curls, look at the curls, okay. And he is the reason why I'm always on the time crunch. But for the first thing I like to put all over my hair is the L'Oreal El Vive or El Vive Hyaluron Plump. It's a super, super hydrating leave-in conditioner. And yeah, I just spray this all over. And I am working on kind of dampish hair just so that, I don't know, it just takes less time to dry once the products are in. But I just spray this all over. And then I'm going to run my detangling brush through my hair once again. Even though it's pretty much already detangled, but I just want to make sure that I evenly distribute all of this product. This also smells so, so good. And I'm using this Careco Mini Tangle Buster. Now that that is all in, I'm going to separate my hair into a few sections to apply my next product. So next I'm going in with this Camille Rose Spiked Honey Mousse. I showed you guys this probably two years ago now and it's been in my hair rotation ever since. I absolutely love it. It leaves my curls so nice and defined. I'm literally almost out of it. I'm kind of afraid that I won't even have enough to do my hair right now, but we'll make it, we'll make it work. A little bit does go a long way, so I'll try to be not too generous. And it smells like butterscotch, it smells so good. And if you want those really nice and defined curls, try this brush from Bounce Curl. It has these little ridges here that really help to separate the curls and just define them so nicely. It is a little pricey, I think it's like $26 for one brush. That's almost $30 for a brush, which is crazy. I don't know. I'm not mad that I bought it, but just beware. Maybe you can find a sale or something. I think I might have a 10% code or link that you guys can use. If I do, I'll have it in my description box. I don't even think I get money from it, but I think you guys might be able to get 10% off, which is a little something. Yeah. Yeah. So you guys can see how it's separating my curls. And then this is what they look like after. I just do a little scrunch. Go. And I don't do this to every like inch of my hair because if I do this literally all over, I won't get as much volume as I like. So I just do it to a few pieces in each section and that usually works for me and I like the way my hair looks when I do that. So I finished applying all the product and running the brush through my hair, but for one last little hurrah, I'm gonna put a little bit more of this in my hand and then scrunch this all over my hair. And I'm actually gonna flip my hair upside down to do this. And that's it for now. I'm going to let it air dry for a little bit and then I'll be back to diffuse. 
Okay, it's been probably like an hour or so. My hair is like 50% dry. I'm gonna go in with my Tymo Air Hype and the diffuser attachment. And you'll see that I always start by just hovering my hair without touching and then I'll go in and start scrunching. Also, this diffuser has like different prong settings. So when I wanna scrunch, I just extend the prongs out and this helps give my hair some more volume as well. So now that my hair is completely dry, I'm gonna go in with some hair oil and fluff it out a little bit. I'm using this Old Plex number seven bonding oil. I also like to use this little pick to fluff it out even more. 